Good evening. The Peters Township School Board censured one of its own members today, which could seriously impact his reelection campaign. The board member is accused of posting racist comments and pictures to his Facebook page. Ralph Iannotti spoke with him and the board president tonight during a school board meeting. Ralph. Yeah, thanks very much, guys. On the eve of tomorrow's primary election, the Peters Township School Board tonight censured one of its own because of social media posts. The veteran school board member is up for re-election, and his name is on the ballot tomorrow. The board will not allow these types of discriminatory and hate speech messages to be attributed to the Peters Township School District. Peter's school board president, Thomas McMurray, introduced the measure to censure school board director William Merrill because of inflammatory racist comments and hate speech that appeared on Merrill's Facebook account. The posts have since been deleted. McMurray noted the board has no control over individual social media posts and it does not have the legal authority to remove an elected official for misconduct. The board publicly censures William Merrill for his violation of school policy. Many of those who showed up here for this meeting wanted Merrill to voluntarily step down. He's up for re-election in tomorrow's primary. This is despicable. This has no place in a community such as this. And I hope that um, you will light of day and resign. My five-year-olds would be grounded for comments that you said, and they know better. I think the best thing for you to do would be to step down. As long as Mr. Merrill is a leader in the district, these posts and these actions will put into question votes, actions, statements made by this governing body. For his part, Merrill apologized for his posts, saying he realized they may have caused harm, but he did not make any retraction. So I would like to apologize to, uh, like I said, the board, the district, and the community for any comment that I have made or that has been attributed to me. All right. Um, I'm sorry. Thank you. Now, most people in the audience tonight seem satisfied with the uh, censure vote. Uh, some obviously wanted more, but they were glad that uh, the school board didn't just push it aside and say it's under investigation. We're live tonight in Washington County. I'm Ralph Iannotti, KDKA News.